What is going on guys, Marijn here and welcome to a new episode of My Shredded Lifestyle. Now first things first, I'll show you guys what I was weighing this morning and as you can see it was a little bit um, higher than the day before, but that is something that happens, all right? Weight fluctuations is something you have to accept. You cannot stress over it, right? So the way that I calculated is that I take the weekly average of all my numbers instead of looking at it per day. Um, and that is why it's important to weigh yourself every single day because you want to take that average because, you know, it could just be so that you weigh yourself only uh, every single Monday, right? But on the night before that, on the Sunday, for example, you had a meal later that night of the second week and then your weight will be higher than the first week, even though that next day or the day before on Saturday or the day on Monday, your weight may actually be lower, right? Simply because that one day, it was a little bit different because of those fluctuations. That's why it's smart to weigh yourself every morning, then take the average of seven days and uh, you go by that. Anyway, as you guys can see, I'm currently at the airport in Amsterdam, Schiphol. I'm about to fly to London for another adventure, right? It's gonna be fun. Let's get the video started. Having a great flight time today. I had to wake up at seven this morning. So that is very acceptable. It's just gonna be a nice long day, right? So I am fasting right now at the airport. We'll probably have my first meal, definitely have my first meal in London because I think I'll arrive at 11.30. The time also goes back a little bit uh, with one hour, right? So having this large Americano, sugar-free vanilla and something very, very important here. When you fly, and I mean, most people don't fly too often, but when you do, it is very, very crucial to stay hydrated it's literally a major hack i used to not really do this i've really noticed that if i don't stay hydrated and i fly i feel like shit first of all but next to that my workouts are absolutely horrible after the flight so that's that time to board the flight right now on my way to the Airbnb and I can't even explain in words how stoked I am for these next coming days right because first of all we're gonna do a lot of cool shit but mostly it is the people that I've just missed I haven't seen a lot of these guys in a while right so it's gonna be so much fun and there's also a new Alpha Lead Adley that I haven't met before either let's go to the Airbnb and see everyone there you made it fam <laughs> what's up hello <laughs> so hi good to see you. you too hi hi <laughs> hola what's up My man! <laughs> What's up, bro? So here we got the Airbnb, looking sick. We even have Greek aesthetic gods in here and everything. Elevator, all right, all right. Damn. So big. I know. What the fuck? <laughs> it's like a mansion. <laughs> it's a maze. Oh. There's more upstairs. Bro. What up? So, bro. <laughs> Still alive. Week, bro. <laughs> nice place, right? This area is amazing. Saying. Get some rest. Get ready for these few days. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So I'll be staying here with Nabil. Hey. So we just got settled. It's time for some food now. And I am actually still fasted. 2.30. Solid. So I went for four chicken thighs, spicy rice, corn on the cob, and extra chicken. Getting a protein. Chicken. <laughs> chicken. <laughs> First it's time. Yeah. It's so good. <laughs> so bro. Hey, Everybody's having that nose. We got Brandon here bringing his own meals. Dude, you'll be on the same thing soon. Yeah, you yeah. will be. You're right. Oh so, uh, when are you competing? How long will you left? Seven and a half weeks. You and Christian are like, do a little competition so you can get leaner faster, right? We'll I've had a little bit of a head start. I, I can't be part yeah. of that. Nah, Christian is starting next week, I think. And I started a week ago. I'm um, using That's because Christian. Track. That's because Christian. I'm starting, I'm starting it like this week. I'm just yeah? gonna ease into it. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. About to make a stop now at the grocery store. Because additionally to like eating out, I don't want to do that most of the time, of course, because I am cutting. I do want to still track my food intake, right? So um, when I'm eating out, I just keep it basic. And next to that, picking up most of my own food. So going hard on the fruits, got apples, mango, blueberry, grapes. 
pineapple everything guys and now we're gonna pick up some protein too i'm thinking some king prawns would be nice 150 grams each 10 protein three carb zero fat perfect we got tuna here that's already drained ready to eat for if it really comes down to it uh one vodka please this one's yeah 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 that's the only one i have right Emily doesn't believe it. Eggs like, do not have to go in the fridge. Like, yeah, we are about to settle this. What do you say? Eggs in the fridge or can you leave them out? Leave them out. Leave them out. Come on. Okay? Exactly. It's always fun, the American and Europe thing. It's true that keeping eggs in the fridge is a weird American quirk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Damn it! Why are we so weird? So I think everybody's about to hit the gym. I actually have a rest day today, but you know, it's the first day here. Um, also, it is Wednesday. You know, I had two days in a row. I can definitely do another upper workout today because I hit legs yesterday. I'm actually really, really excited to work out and then I also feel more, I, like we bought a lot of booze. I think we are definitely gonna drink tonight. That is out of the question, right? So kind of have to train, you know, in order to deserve that, right? So um, it's gonna be a good night. And as far as the food, you know, broke my fast with Nando's. It's 4.45 right now, so I need some extra energy, probably two apples before I hit the session, but I definitely wanna save some calories, right, for tonight if we're gonna drink. Yeah. And then come back at 24. And that's what I want to do. That's, that's One of my friends who also just finished YouTube, he released his own pre workout called Wobs. The reason it's called Wobs is because you know when you go to a festival and the sound of the music is like Wob, Wob, Wob. That's what this pre workout is meant to give you in the gym. Cheers, bro. Uh, water. You know, swallow it. No? Without water. Yeah, just swallow it. Just like get some spit and then like. That's fucked up. Did yeah. you do it? Yeah, I did. Yes. We got it in us. <laughs> We got the goodies in us. Now it's time to wait until the kicks in. It's been a long day already, man. Kind of tired, to be honest, so we need it. So we finally found a gym, it's called Pure Gym, and I'm pretty sure this is the gym where me and Veronica went um, when we left London that last day. Solid gym, and we can definitely film here. So honestly, guys, I think, busiest gym I've ever trained at. We got a little bit of space here, All right? We're just gonna improvise today. I'm supposed to have a rest day today. I'm gonna split the upper body, so I'm gonna do a pull today and then push tomorrow, right? Come on. Look at this guy, man. Fuck. That's insane. <laughs> Bruh. How much do you weigh? Right now? Yeah. 93 kilos? Shit, man. 93. Highest weight I've been was 90 kilos. <laughs> That's a hard. little bit shorter. A little, a little bit shorter, bit. even, man. The heaviest I've ever been was. 103 kilos. So started with dumbbell row, just a solid choice, you know, and I especially need that back thickness more than the back width. Um, I also can't really do weighted pull-ups here. They have pull-up stations, but they're all freaking taken. It's so busy here. As I said, we gotta improvise, man. I'm just gonna do a freestyle session. Pretty high rep. Um, also the 10 and 12 reps here. The pre-workout is kicking in. I feel fired up. We're just gonna freaking blast. Workout done was definitely a good one, not the best, you know, but we definitely made it work with what we had. So back at the Airbnb now, let me quickly show you guys what I currently look like. I think the mass is pretty on point. I just really cannot wait for my abs to come out, you know, you can really tell. There's plenty of fat that I need to lose here. Dude, how could you do this to me? 
Uh, that's my last week, bro. Yeah, that's you were doing the exact same Christian's thing. about to start dieting. So everybody picked up pizza here. Yeah, I decided I to skip to out and to eat some healthy yeah. meal. What a loser. <laughs> what a loser. Yeah. Everyone I'm go take, unsubscribe. I'm taking this shit serious, man. I'm taking this shit serious. You guys are proud of me, right? Thumbs up if you're proud of me. Oh, anyway, man. we went to this Pizza Express place instead of Domino's and they had a low calorie pizza. So I decided to go for that. Less than 600 calories. But let's actually see what this looks like, right? I have no idea. On, Give us a bite. Oh God! Well, I feel like that might be the thumbnail. <laughs> Everybody's enjoying madly. Now I gotta say that my pizza does not look yeah, as good as this. Oh uh, yeah, it actually looks kind of weird. God. So it's obviously not the best pizza I ever had, but it's definitely solid. And I'm able to fit it in now, right? So that's good. Now the deeper I get into my diet, the less I want to eat this because the volume is not much. As you can see, I'm out for like 35 days. I'm Busted, bro. <laughs> Pint of white. <laughs> so it's the next day right now after that pizza last night. Uh, we just had some drinks with the crew here at the house. Just casual evening, good conversations, good chats. And I'm obviously catching up with everybody and getting to know each other as well because we're with a pretty big group now. Overall, Lots of fun. What I decided to do during this trip is to make multiple vlogs and I make them a little bit shorter. So rather than like one big one of the London trip, because I also don't see all of these people too often. So now that we're together, I just look forward to like having everybody on the video and for you guys to get to know them as well, right? So if you're excited, make sure to hit that subscribe button for the next coming videos. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up as well. Highly appreciate it. And I'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.